Hello and welcome to another indie horror game. This time I'll be playing the demo to Fear the Spotlight, and if you want to play this for yourselves, the links and the details are down below in the description, alright? Now this is going to be a PS1 inspired third person survival horror where I'm going to be exploring a school in search of my missing friend, and it looks like a great deal of fun. Really hope you enjoy it. If you do, leave your support down below, but let's begin the demo. So, my friend Amy was supposed to meet me in the library after school, but she never showed up. I searched and found her wandering into a section of the school that was burned down years ago. I know I'm not supposed to go in here, but something's up with Amy, and I have to find her. Alright, well, let's go find my friend. Wow, look at this. Yep, certainly PS1 inspired, low poly, sort of low FPS as well. At least we got a flashlight. Oh wow, look at this, it's all chained up. Is this how I got in? How did I get through that? No leaving. Right. Okay. Okay, so it's right click to crouch, and we can sneak around. Yeah, this is going to be a stealth survival horror. I'm not going to be alone here. Oh shit. Here we go. <laughs> right on cue. Look at that guy. I know you're here somewhere. Where are you? I'm going to find you, my little starlet. Right, so, that's the spotlight. That's the spotlight I need to fear. Is he gonna go away? Oh good, okay. Uh... Ooh, I like the audio. Is it safe to come out? Right. Okay. I love this, by the way. She's like a champion squatter. Nice crab walk she's got. Right. Let's see. Okay, there's something over here. Something I can use? What we got? Oh, it's an inhaler. This will be helpful if my health is ever low and my lungs need some relief. Right, okay, so escape for the inventory? Okay, wonderful. Alright, so obviously I got the flashlight, there's the inhaler. I've also got a letter for Amy. The letter I was going to give to Amy in the library. Uh, examine, yeah. I really poured my heart out in this letter. I hope I can give this to her. Ah, oh, well, I hope you can too. So, my health is my lungs. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. Um, let's not go that way, maybe. What we got here? What is this? Sunnyside Theatre. Alright. Can we go through? Oh, yeah. Seems to work. Alright. What we got here, then? Something on the floor? It's a handwritten note. Hey, Melissa. I stole the drama room key like you asked. I have it stashed in my locker in the journalism class. The combo is your birthday. Will you go with me to the movies now like you promised? Hmm, this kid really liked Melissa. Okay. Uh, a hanged man there? It's got a picture of a hanged man, yeah, that's right. Okay, I'm taking that down. But now I can have a look at this. Right, the placard says, a, a tragic beginning. Okay. Um, well, can I just put this back? Right, it fits. Okay. And it looks like we've got three others. Okay, so let's have a look at the placards. What needs to go up here? So, this is a dazzling performance. Okay, I don't have that at the moment. This one, what would that be? Spied lovers meeting. Okay. And this is a fate split between death and love. Again, I don't have it. There is something down here on the floor, though. Okay. Oh, it's it's got a poster inside. And it's got a picture of a skull and a boy's face on it. Well, actually, that one might go here, then? Let's see. What was it? A fate split between death and love. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, let's try that. Apparently, it fits. I, I don't know if it always says that. Uh, but, yeah, alright. We're looking for two more. Am I safe here? I'm getting some nice, almost save room-like music, so maybe. There's no lock on this door, but it won't budge. Strange. Maybe it's got something to do with the posters. I'm noticing that I can't run around, or it doesn't seem like I can anyway. What we got up here? Is that a photo? A uh, bulletin board, right. It's mostly filled with school flyers with some boring announcements. There's a single photo of a group of students with their teacher. 
Below the photo it reads, Drama Club, Mr. Crane. Okay. Hmm. Right, well, let's go back out. Probably into the danger zone. Where is the spotlight? He went down there, didn't he? Right, there's another door here. Looks like I might be able to use it. Oh, this is the journalism class. Right. We're going in. Okay. Alright. Uh, oh, hang on. We've got a lot of lockers here. I can use this one. Second from the left. The locker's locked, but it looks like I can open it with the right combination. Oh, alright. I think I just maybe skipped past the combination there. Right, there we go. There we go. Okay, so four digits. Didn't I read that it's it's uh, someone's birthday? Melissa's birthday? I need to find out what Melissa's birthday is, I suppose. I'll come back to this. Um, an overhead projector? That takes me back. <laughs> yep. Looks like the power switch still works, but the light bulb isn't turning on. I bet I could fix this projector with the right materials. Right, so maybe it needs a new light bulb? Alright, I guess I'll keep an eye out. What have we got around here? Is that another poster? Oh no, no, this is a handwritten note. Did you hear? Amber got six, so now Chrissy's getting the lead in the play. Of course, we get skipped over for the part. Ugh. I convinced Bobby to steal the drama room key so we can ruin her costume. He's such a sucker for me. And there's Melissa again. Yeah, I guess bullies exist in every generation. Ain't that the truth? Okay. Something over here on the counter. Is that another inhaler? It is, yeah. Okay. Good stuff. Um, so, let's see. Where does this go? Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, I don't like that. Hang on. Oh, he's out and about. Okay, right. Maybe it's time to go back into class. I don't know. Let's go. Go on, go, 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 go. <laughs> I don't know if you can follow me through doors. Let's hope not. Okay, there's something over there as well, by the looks of it. What is it? Uh, a newspaper. A school newspaper. And it reads, The premiere of The Phantom of the Opera will be coming this fall. We interviewed the teacher in charge of the production, Mr. Crane, about the show. I can't believe this school had a newspaper and drama club. They didn't bring these back after the fire. Hmm. We got anything? Oh. Oh, there's a couple of things over here. Oh, is that? That could be another poster. Yeah, it's a tube with a poster in it. This one's got two people holding hands. Wasn't one of them spied lovers or something like that? That could be that one. Let's see. Okay, something in the top drawer. A clipboard that reads, Please provide your birthday so we can include you on the monthly birthday celebrations. Ah, here we go. Well, this, this could be the combination then. Is it... Is it 0517? Cake will be provided at each celebration. Probably not today, but let's try that. 0517. Okay, so... 0517. Yes! Okay! Jackpot! I'm in! And we find the key for the drama class. Okay. Uh, that probably means I need to go back out into the corridor and find the drama class. I don't know which door's more favorable. <laughs> Let's choose this one. Yeah. And as soon as I go through, my ass is on the ground. Where did he go? Seems like he's disappeared again. Okay, that one's chained up. I assume this isn't the drama class. No. Okay. It seems kind of weird that we can't run. I mean, if I get spotted, what do I do? Just walk away? This one? Oh, this is it. This is the drama class. Of course, the door is locked, but no worries. I've got the key. It fits. The door is unlocked. I've got to say, early impressions are pretty good. I quite like this. Okay. Doesn't look like he's in the room, so that's good. What we got here? Alright, inside there's, well, there's something down here. A bunch of old scripts and stuff for the theatre class. And there's a bunch of pictures of the students, too. They look like they're having fun. Wait, is this my friend Amy in here? There are so many pictures of her. Wait a second. No, this can't be her. 
These pictures are dated 25 years ago. Wow. Sure looks like her, though. Weird. Maybe her mum? Hmm. Yeah, maybe. Or oh, there's some time travel shenanigans going on. I don't know. Can I? I can. Why did I press that? Oh, for fuck's sake, why did I press that? Okay, it looks like we can actually go up on stage here, if you can call this a stage. What's this? It's another script for a school rendition of The Phantom of the Opera. On the cover it reads, starring Amber. But the name Amber is crossed out and written above is Chrissy. Yeah, some last minute changes. Okay. Do I want to put on a costume? No? Okay, uh... Looks like there's something over here. What is that? Oh, it's a photo of the school. But there's something odd about it. It looks like there's something behind it. Oh, no, you mentioned it, yeah. Ah. What's that? There's a panel back here. But it's shut tight. I'll need some way to remove these screws if I want to search behind the panel. So, we're looking for a light bulb. We're looking for a screwdriver, I guess. Uh, I might find something back here. Another photo. A bunch of awards for the drama teacher. Must be old, since we don't even have a drama class anymore. This one says, Teacher of the Year. There's a yearbook snippet for the dreamiest teacher. And it goes on. Huh. I wonder. The spotlight that's roaming around the school, is he meant to be the drama teacher? That might be the last poster that I need. Yep, there's a poster inside, and this one... Has a girl on stage. Uh, what was the other one? Like a dazzling performance. Something like that. Maybe that's that. Alright, well... Whoa! <laughs> okay, he doesn't need to use doors, apparently. Jeez. Poor boy. Oh no, it's that thing again! I need to find a way out of this room. I need to sneak past without letting it see me. Now, good luck with that. Wow, okay. Um... Well, uh, maybe I could use the hole that it created? Okay. Oh, I don't like this. Is he just gonna go back and forth? Alright, I might have to make a break for it. Ooh. Ooh. Around here, maybe? Ooh. Ooh. Oh, shit. Oh, I really do not like this. Okay. Go, 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 oh, man, it's outrageous that you can't run, but I did seem to make it. Seems like the music really picks up when you put yourself in danger and you're more exposed. I quite like that. Right, okay, so going through here should be okay, right? Should be safe, it shouldn't be here. Uh, so, let's see, two left. This is the dazzling performance one, right? Okay. The woman on stage, and the two people holding hands. It's It's gotta be the woman on stage, right? Unless I got the first one wrong. Hmm. Well, let's see if this works. Okay, a spied lovers meeting, two people holding hands. It's gotta be, right? Gotta be. It fits! It fits, the door unlocks. And we are through! Alright, I did it! The doors are open! This must be where Amy's gone. I hope she's okay. Hmm. Truthfully, I hope that I find a screwdriver or a light bulb. I want to see what's going to be projected. I want to see what's inside that cupboard. This is going to be the end of the demo, isn't it? Yep. Okay. Well, I want to find the light bulb, I want to find the screwdriver, and I want to play more of this game. I actually really quite enjoyed that. And if you did as well, and you want to see this when it comes out, let me know, alright? Thank you very much for watching. See you next time. This is going to be a stealth survival horror. I'm not going to be alone here. Oh shit. Here we go. <laughs> right on cue. An overhead projector. That takes me back. <laughs> I don't know if you can follow me through doors. Let's hope not. Alright. Well. Whoa. <laughs> okay. He doesn't need to use doors apparently. Oh, oh, oh shit. Oh, I really do not like this.